Mikey, let's sail on our ship. We decided to make a trip around the world. Our ship is very big and beautiful. I have long dreamed of swimming in the ocean. Why are they so excited now? What happened? You won't believe it. Now we have learned that a meteor shower is about to hit our planet. We need to escape as soon as possible. It happened so suddenly. The good thing is that we are now hiding in the warehouse. Our ship could sink at any moment. We are in great danger. Huh? JJ, we're on a desert island. Unfortunately, our ship crashed after a meteor shower and pieces of it scattered everywhere. I do not know where our family is and I have a real panic. What you see is that there is some kind of abandoned house there. Let's see if we can find anything in the boxes. I really want to eat and drink water. Then, let's take a closer look at what's in the remaining boxes that were thrown out of the ocean. After that, we will immediately run to the abandoned house. I want to see what's in there. Uh-oh. I think we'll find at least something to survive on this desert island. Apparently, no one has lived here for a long time, and these places have been abandoned. <gasps> I still can't believe we're in such a terrible situation. Unfortunately, we have no other choice. Therefore, now we can only inspect abandoned houses and take at least some materials from there. I still don't understand where my wife and son are. Hmm. While you were unconscious, I ran all along the shore and they were gone. We'll need to find them after that. This is really a tragedy. But unfortunately, we have to concentrate now and find as many materials as possible that we need. If we don't survive on our own, we'll never save our families. It is very dangerous to be in this house right now because it can collapse at any moment. Unfortunately, we haven't found anything yet. Ho <laughs> ho! But I'm definitely not going to give up. Mikey, there's a descent to the basement. Let's go down! I want to see what's in the basement. I see from above that you found some kind of chest. Take all the necessary materials from there as soon as possible and go upstairs. We need to run away urgently. I think the tree that you found will definitely be useful to us in order to build a small hut for ourselves. We need to live somewhere, and after that we'll start looking for food. I am very glad that we found at least some materials. Now we have a chance to survive on this desert island. I think I've come up with a very good idea. Hmm. Let's go to the forest and pick berries, mushrooms. I'm going to make a hut for now. I hope that we will be able to see each other soon. Try to collect as much food as possible. Okay, then I ran. Woohoo! Mikey's gone into the woods now. I'm going to build a hut for now. It won't take me much time, and the main thing is to put up a column. Mikey will also have to bring me some foliage in order to make a canopy. I'm going to keep working for now. The good thing is that we found a carpet and a tree. I'm going fishing now, because if I can catch someone, then we can cook our own food on the campfire. It's going to be really cool. I was very worried, but now we seem to be doing well. He should be back soon, so I'll just go fishing and wait for the fish to get on my hook. I see that there are really a huge number of different marine life in the ocean here. It seems that someone is pecking now. I did catch a fish, and now I have a very tasty meal. It seems to me, or Mikey is running here now. I've been waiting for you for so long. Hooray! I brought the foliage you were talking about. It will be useful to us for a hut. But the most important thing is that I couldn't find berries and mushrooms. <laughs> Therefore, it's better that I go fishing now, and in the meantime, you build a house. By the way, I completely forgot. I have some small seeds. We can make a vegetable garden now and grow some plants. Mikey, then I'm getting started as soon as possible to finally make a vegetable garden. I think the house will be done a little later. Now I have already taken a hoe and a rake. Hmm. I am very good at making a vegetable garden, so now I will use the land and put water to it. I need to pour the seeds into the ground as soon as possible because I want to get a large number of plants. <laughs> I'm fishing now and I'm very happy about it. I see that you are very tired and working hard. But for now, the best thing to do at the moment is to fish. In no case should we be distracted because we will have nothing to eat. 
I have not been so happy for a long time, but to be honest, now I will give you a huge amount of fish. For now, do the construction of the house. I won't bother you. Great! Ho oh, ho! That's right. I still need to make a canopy for a hut. I've been working hard in the garden. The good thing is that I planted all the seeds and now I'm starting to equip the house. At least we'll have a place to live and sleep. Mikey, it seems that we are making our home pretty good now. And I really like it. Hurry up here and show me what kind of fish you managed to catch during this time. <laughs> we urgently need to eat and replenish our strength. That's how many fish I caught. Take it for yourself, but you will definitely need to cook it because it is raw. I still have a lot to do in the forest. I have to pick berries and mushrooms. I'll run there. Woohoo! Mikey has just run away once again. I'll do the cooking for now and go fishing a little more. There is time until evening, so I have to replenish our food supplies. Night has fallen. Some of the plants have already grown in the garden. Why isn't Mikey coming back? Huh? I think I see him running out of the woods right now. Tell me what news you have. You'll believe me, but I was still able to collect even more materials. These are stones and everything else. Therefore, take it for yourself soon. We can make ourselves normal tools and weapons from this. I'm going to bed for now because I'm very tired. You watch carefully so that no one comes here. Woohoo! Go to bed! I'm going to observe everything from the sidelines for now, and I don't want anyone to attack us. Now, Mikey's gone and laid down on the floor. And he liked the delicious food, ate, and sleeps. For now, I'm going to make a bow and arrow out of the materials that Mikey brought. We need to protect ourselves with something, because wild animals can come here. Oh no! I just saw the wolves and they're coming here! We need to wake Mikey up urgently because they can tear him apart! Mikey, wake up right now! Why are you still sleeping and not going to get up? The wolves are coming here, so I'll try to chase them away! I don't understand where they've gone now! You need to look around carefully! I think I see them! They're surrounding our hut right now! You need to take a torch and scare them away with fire. Oh. Maybe they will leave. Two wolves are very dangerous because they are very angry and they have sharp teeth. I don't know what to do. Therefore, now I will try to scare them in every possible way. They're chasing me now and they want to eat me. Uh oh I'm starting to panic, but in no case can this be allowed. I don't seem to have any other options left. Now I will urgently run to inspect the remaining boxes and take a rope from there. Because I need to drive them away with arrows and my bow is not ready. Uh-oh. We are in a very dangerous situation right now. Mickey is still sleeping and I have to chase away these terrible wolves. The good thing is that they are afraid of fire and don't come too close to me. I'm scared. I'm shooting at wolves. I hope that I can drive them away now with the help of arrows. I can't believe my eyes. They are really scared now and are starting to run away. <laughs> I was very pleased that I was still able to use the bow and arrow correctly. Now I'm really getting on with my life. I'll set up torches so it's light. I slept so well just now. Surprisingly, it's already morning and it's time to run into the forest. We still have a lot of things to do today. This time, you will come with me because it is very scary for me to walk alone in the forest. I don't understand why you're so outraged right now. As if you don't like something. I think you didn't get enough sleep. Look what I saw. Mikey, is it my imagination or is it bloodstains now? I'm very surprised that you haven't noticed them before. But let's quickly see where they lead. It's actually very creepy, and I don't understand where they came from here. Right now, the traces of blood are increasing. Most likely, we are getting even closer. Oh no, just look at it. It's your wife who's lying on the floor, and she's covered in blood. I don't understand why she's not moving. Oh, I still can't believe I found her now. This is very bad. I think I'm starting to panic because I do not know what to do. Let's try to help her in some way soon. We need to keep running because the blood trails don't stop. They will surely lead us to the terrible murderer who committed this crime, the horror. Hurry up and run. We need to act very carefully now, but we can't waste time. It seems that we have just run to the lair of a maniac. My wife is being held captive by him right now. How is this even possible? 
I don't understand why she's sitting in a cage right now and being bullied. Let's watch from the sidelines now. I think he will return to the lair soon and we will be able to surprise him. You have no idea how angry I am. Calm down, and most importantly, don't be nervous now. I think we will resolve all these issues in the near future. Now let's hide behind a tree. It seems that someone is coming here. This is the maniac I told you about. Ugh. Just look, there's a huge amount of blood and I'm very worried about it. Let's try to approach him now and hit him from behind. I'm going to do it because he killed my wife. I can see that he doesn't notice us at all and doesn't hear us. So hit as hard as you can so that he can't survive. I see what we are doing very well. Mikey's almost got to him now. All that's left is to hit him on the head. To be honest, I want to destroy him for doing such terrible and disgusting things. We managed to hit him, but now we need to free my wife. <laughs> destroy this cage soon. Let her get out because there are red hot coals below her, which heat the place where your wife is standing. You freed her, she'll be safe right away, and we'll figure out how to resurrect my wife. I am very glad that we managed to free her. To be honest, I'm in a good mood right now. Get out of the cage. I'm very glad that I managed to free you and you won't suffer like this anymore. Now, we have to help Mikey urgently. <laughs> because unfortunately, his wife was killed and we found her in the woods. Let's make some potion now. I see that there is a cauldron here. Thanks to this, we will be able to revive it, but now in no case should mistakes be made. <laughs> I'm really worried right now. I want to make a potion as soon as possible in order to resurrect my wife. It seems to be working, and I still have a special elixir now that can revive her. All that remains is to put it in a special container, and we can immediately run to save it. Therefore, let's not waste time and go to the forest as soon as possible. My wife must be saved. Mikey, we need to hurry up. I don't want us to have any problems. I'm running as fast as I can to save your wife right now. All we have to do is resurrect her. I think everything will work out. The main thing is not to worry. Woohoo! I'll give her the elixir soon. Now we can only watch from the side when she lives. It seems to have worked out and I am very happy about it. Let's run away in search of children. Well, where are we going to look? I don't understand, because at the moment we'll have to run around most of the forest to find them. It will not be so easy to do. I doubt that we will succeed. I really want to find my son, because I miss him. I feel that they are somewhere nearby. Hmm. Let's take a close look at every part of the forest now and work together to find them. A strange feeling. Mikey, look! I see now that our sons are lying in the middle of the lake. Let's try to swim to them and pick them up. We have to bring them back to consciousness. I hope they are not badly hurt and will be able to move. It's very hard for me to look at it. It breaks my heart, but the good thing is that we found them after all. Oh! And now we have already sailed almost to the place where they lie and take them in our arms. I'm not going to stay here anymore. Therefore, I have now put my son on my neck and will take him to the shore. I am very glad that they are all right and they are not very badly hurt. Therefore, now we need to start building a new ship. We must sail away from this uninhabited island as soon as possible. So now you're going to do the construction and I'll have to go into the woods with my family. I want to finish a couple of things. Uh oh, I'll have to build this ship alone. You know it's very hard, but if you really need to leave, then do it. I don't want to get distracted right now because I have a lot of work to do. I still want to finish building the ship as soon as possible. Now we need to collect as many materials as possible in order to build a ship. I will do it in the middle of this lake because I have no other options. At the moment, everything is going well for me because our families have been reunited. We are no longer in danger. The main thing is just to concentrate on work and not be distracted. The ship needs to be made of very strong materials because we are going to have a very long and difficult voyage. But I definitely don't want to stay on this island anymore. <laughs> Super! I'm very good at setting up the ship right now. I did not expect that in such a short time, I would have already started the most important part of the ship. It will be small and the main thing is that everything fits. Mikey, he put all the work on me again, but to be honest, he wasn't too upset because he doesn't know how to build a ship at all. He would only bother me and constantly make me distracted. 
There's not much left, and I think they'll be back soon. The main thing is to concentrate on work. I have already completed most of the floor of the ship and am already starting to install the steering wheel and seats. I will be the captain, and no one will be able to argue with this because no one manages ships better than me. <laughs> My son and I have worked very well, and I believe that our ship is basically ready. We can already go on a long journey on it. Now we just have to wait for Mikey to come back here. I wonder how much longer it will take me to wait for him. I'm going to keep an eye on the forest now because Mikey should be back any minute. There's no point in waiting any longer. We are ready to sail away. <laughs> we came running and still managed to do the things we wanted to do. We can leave now. I see that your ship is ready and it makes me very happy. Therefore, let's sit down and sail away. We did a great job and managed to survive on this desert island. Now it's time to go home. Ho <laughs> ho! Thank you all so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel, like it, and leave your comments.